Good evening, everyone. How are you? Hi, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Are you ready for action? Yes. 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 Yes, yes I'm ready. Okay. Excellent. I'm going to share a, the class in the chat. One moment, please. Here I am. Yeah. Okay, that's class uh, one. Manual. Manual. No, no, no. No, no the class. The manual you downloaded from from the ah, platform. Yeah. Uh huh. You downloaded from the platform. Now this is a, not the manual, but okay. yes. Uh, I can uh -huh. Excellent. Very we good. Okay. I'm glad that you can see it. Welcome all on board. Okay, let's begin. Okay. Buenas noches, este es el Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo, modalidad online, beginner four. Welcome to your English class. Today is Wednesday, April 19th. This is class one. Count and non-count nouns. Count nouns and non-count nouns. This is the general objective. And this is the specific object. And this is the class object. Participants will be able to ask and answer questions about food and materials using count and non-count nouns correctly by working in groups. Okay. And this is the agenda. We're going to start by discussing favorite food, kinds of nouns, count nouns and non-count nouns, practice, and questions about nouns. Okay, so these are the first things that we need to study. Okay, but before, attendance. Let's go to the attendance. We are only 18, right? Adelaida Carolina Alvarado. Okay. Cindy Janet Goches. Cindy Janet, no. Okay. Daniel Steve Jerez. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Daniela Lisset Guti Gutierrez. Present. Excellent. Nice. Daisy Tatiana Cruz. Daisy. No. Douglas Arturo Hernandez. Excellent. Evelyn Jamilez Molina. The microphone is not working, Douglas. Don't worry, I can see. Okay. Evelyn Jamilez Molina. Juliana Maria Maya. Excellent. Nice. Gloria Marina Melendez. Present teacher. Excellent, Glorita. Nice to see you again. Okay. Guillermo Isaí Delgado. Guillermo Isaí, no. Ileana Estela Serrano. José Miguel Blanco. Julio Aristides 
Paz, Carla y Dari Castillo. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Lady Maricela Linares. Present teacher. Excellent. Liliana Laura Teresa Polio Colio Arce. Liliana Teresa. Liliana Laura Teresa. No, right. Okay. Omar Set Galicia. No. Wilber Francisco Javier. Present teacher. Okay. Excellent. Nice. La lady Maricela Lima. Uh -huh. Yeah. You are here, lady. So, no problem. Okay. Let's continue. Sure. Mi teacher, ya no está la cerrada en el candelario. Ok, excelente. Teacher, yes. Uh, uh, right now, do you listen to me? Sorry, Wilmer. Uh, fue Douglas, teacher. Ah, Douglas. Ah, oh. now, yes, we can hear you, Douglas. Ah, ok, ok. We Thank can you. hear you. No problem. You're welcome. Ok. Ok. Let's begin. Okay. English for Work program, basic module four. Okay. Requerimientos, nombre completo al conectarse a la plataforma. En el caso de oyentes, agregar la palabra oyente, pero los oyentes no son los que no pueden participar ese día porque están ocupados, sino los que son asignados como extra en la clase. Entonces, no podemos ponernos oyentes si no somos oyentes, ¿ok? Solamente si somos, si fuimos asignados como, bueno, ya se cumplió el, el número, que son 20, y hay tres o cuatro más que necesitan ingresar, entonces se ponen como oyentes. Pero eh, si yo tengo que trabajar o tengo que hacer cosas, no soy oyente. Solo ese día no voy a poder participar. Pero no me puedo poner oyente porque no he sido asignado como tal. ¿Ok? Por favor, eh, tomen nota y, y recuerden, si por alguna razón no pueden participar o algo, avisen, ¿verdad? Siempre avisen para poderles ayudar. Eh, la cámara encendida durante toda la sesión, a menos que el internet esté fallando demasiado o que se sientan mal porque todos somos humanos y nos puede suceder que algunos andemos enfermitos. Como yo ahorita ando un poquito, un poquito mal, pero ahí vamos. Hay que hacerlo, ¿verdad? Hay que hacer lo que tenemos que hacer. Hay que ser responsables. Go ahead. Yeah. Here we are. Okay. Minimizar el sonido. Eh, Liliana Polio. Okay. Polio. Sorry. Hello. Polio. Nice to meet you. Yes. Nice to meet you. I'm sorry. Way in the bus. Ah, don't worry. It's okay. It's okay. Welcome on board. Okay. Here, minimizar el sonido ambiente lo más posible. Quiere decir que si estamos viendo televisión o si hay alguien que está viendo televisión, nos alejamos, si es posible, nos alejamos un poco de esta persona que está viendo tele para que el sonido no interfiera y no interrumpa la clase. Eh, sucede que muchas de las, digamos, de las melodías que aparecen en la tele tienen copyright. Y entonces si es, aparecen en la tele, pero se filtran al video, ¿qué pasa? El video, bueno, ya no, ya no sirve. Lo, le ponen eh, que, que infringe los lineamientos de copyright y entonces ya no lo podemos ver. Entonces, por eso les pido, por favor, ¿verdad?, que 
en la medida de lo posible, minimicemos el sonido ambiente. Si hay niños cerca, yo entiendo, es la hora de que los niños quieren estar con ustedes, abrazarlos y bueno, todos hemos pasado por ahí, todos hemos tenido niños pequeños y quieren estar donde uno está. Y está bien, está bien, solo que si están con ellos eh, y ustedes consideran que ellos van a hablar, entonces cierren el micrófono, ¿verdad? Para que no interfiera con la clase. Ok, de ahí participación activa. Quiere decir que si vamos, eh, nos vamos a ir a los grupos pequeños a hacer los ejercicios, eh, vamos a entrar a los grupos pequeños y vamos a participar. Ok, eh, cometer errores es normal. Equivocarnos es de humanos y todos nos equivocamos. Entonces no se preocupen si come, cometen errores de cualquier índole. Entonces, bueno, vamos a tratar de solucionar la situación de alguna forma. Bien, eso es con respecto a los requerimientos. Otra cosa es la asistencia se requiere el 100% de asistencia a las clases. La asistencia no solamente se toma al estar presente, sino también al cumplir con la clase completa. Y para ahorrar tiempo, ahora solo se toma la asistencia en dos ocasiones, a las 8 y a las 9.55. Ya no se toma a las 9 de la noche. Entonces, si ustedes eh, por alguna razón esperan que se les tome asistencia a las 9, recuerden que ya no para que no vayan a estar esperando eso. ¿okay? Solo va a ser en dos ocasiones, a las 8 y a las 9.55. ¿Cómo funciona este asunto? Es sencillo. ¿Cómo funciona? Bueno, funciona de esta manera. Si ustedes, por, por decir algo, eh, ustedes llegaron tarde a la clase, 25, 25 minutos... De, si, si llegaron 25 minutos tarde a la clase, no se preocupen. Desde el momento en que ustedes entraron, eh, el programa empieza a contar los minutos. Aunque yo no, lo, no la haya o no lo haya visto entrar, el programa sí lo vio entrar. Y en, allí empieza a contarle los minutos. Y el programa reporta los minutos. Y esos minutos son los que se ponen en el, allí en el en la lista. Así es que no se preocupen si por alguna razón eh, entraron tarde y piensan que perdieron eh, el llamado de asistencia, pero no, en realidad no. Vale. Se tomará como válida al escuchar al participante decir presente o presente. <risa> presente o presente, ¿verdad? Y tener la cámara encendida. Como les dije, si por alguna razón, porque no tienen muchos datos si quieren ahorrar algo o porque el internet está bastante malo y ustedes dicen, bueno, no voy a encender la cámara ahorita porque me va a consumir muchos datos o la batería de mi celular está baja. Entonces, entonces lo que pueden hacer es, aunque no enciendan la cámara, pero digan presente, ¿okay? presente y ahí se les tomará la asistencia. Ahora. Hay unas, al final de la clase, hay 10 minutos para diferentes personas a través del curso. Esos 10 minutos son para explicarles algún tema que ustedes no hayan entendido. Y no son uh, aleatoriamente que se, se, digamos, asignan. No, eso es solamente si usted es el número uno de la lista, hoy tiene sus 10 minutos. Si es el número 2, mañana tiene sus 10 minutos. Si es el número 3, pasado mañana tiene así, ¿verdad? De, dependiendo del número de lista que usted tenga, ese número de día le tocará quedarse conmigo para eh, revisar alguna cosa que no haya entendido. Ahora, esa es una ayuda extra. Si por alguna razón... Ustedes no necesitan ayuda porque todo va claro, todo está claro y prefieren irse a la plataforma a trabajar de una vez en la tarea para acostarse temprano, pues también está bien, no hay problema, ¿verdad? Ok, pero sí, las sesiones uno a uno están disponibles. 
Okay. Eh, otra cosa, la, eso no solamente es acerca de la clase que se acaba de ver. Puede ser acerca de un tema que los inquiete, un tema que ustedes no dominen, un tema que hemos estudiado, pero que ustedes no lo entendieron a su cabalidad. Entonces ustedes pueden preguntar, teacher, miren, no entendí esto, ¿verdad? Y con gusto se les ayuda, aunque no sea la clase de ese día, ¿verdad? Ahora, los permisos, dice aquí permisos no disponibles. ¿A qué se refiere con permisos no disponibles? Bueno, sucede una cosa. Los únicos que pueden dar permiso son los señores de Insafor. Solo ellos pueden dar permiso. Y yo no tengo eh, la autoridad para dar permiso. Si usted me dice, mire, Ticha, fíjese que tengo este y este problema, yo voy a saber que usted tiene ese problema. Y con todo el corazón le quisiera ayudar y quisiera decirle, mire, tiene permiso. Lamentablemente no es así, porque no tengo la autoridad para darle permiso. Oye, entonces eso es con la asistencia. Ahora, con las evaluaciones. En las evaluaciones es necesario tener el 80% del promedio de las tareas. O sea, si usted va a la plataforma justo después de la clase, eh, usted va a encontrar el video subido, el de ayer, los, lo, lo van a subir al día siguiente, digamos, lo subirían hoy temprano por la mañana y ya le aparece. Entonces usted llega y responde preguntas, hace lo que tiene que hacer y usted avanza lo más que pueda en la plataforma. Si hoy no puede, bueno, sería bueno que el día siguiente lo hiciera doble. Ok, las tareas... Ajá, alguien está manchando mi pantalla. Vamos a ver quién es. No, teacher, no, no me vaya a regañar. No, no voy a regañar a nadie. Okay. Vaya, eh, si us... para poder completar el curso es necesario que esté presente y que cumpla con las tareas. Las tareas se encuentran en la plataforma justo después de cada clase. Todas las tareas eh, de los temas ya cubiertos tienen que estar completas antes de cada viernes a la medianoche. En el caso nuestro, hemos iniciado miércoles. Entonces tienen que estar completas para el martes. Martes a la medianoche ya tienen que estar completas. El reporte en este caso tendría que ser miércoles porque se completa. La semana completa es la que se reporta. Ahora, la fecha límite para terminar el examen medio, el midterm exam, es el miércoles 3 de mayo, antes de la medianoche. Ustedes cuenten dos semanas. Antes de completarse esas dos semanas, el examen medio, el midterm, debe estar completado. La fecha límite para terminar el examen final Final exam es el miércoles 17 de mayo antes de la medianoche. Terminamos el curso el 18. Entonces es necesario haber terminado eso. Bien, el manual, el manual puede ser descargado de la plataforma y no se utiliza material de terceros en ninguna sesión. Por esta razón no podemos presentar ni videos de YouTube ni tampoco podemos presentar listening de algún libro o algo, ¿verdad? Porque es, tienen copyright, entonces no, no podemos infringir los derechos de copyright o los derechos de autor. Ok, esto sería y de ahí la plataforma. Ustedes son duchos para utilizar esto, ya saben cómo, pero de todas formas tenemos el botón de silencio, le damos clic y es mute, ya no, ya no se puede hablar. Si usted lo quiere desbloquear, solo le da clic otra vez y ya está desbloqueado. La cámara, de igual manera, le da clic sobre la cámara y enciende la cámara si está apagada o si le da clic y está encendida, la apaga. De ahí el chat. Eh, a la par están los participantes, creo que solamente a mí me salen, pero a ustedes le aparece el chat a la par. 
De hecho, tengo cinco mensajes ya de chat eh, que alguien se preocupa que ya pasaron la asistencia y se quedó fuera. No, no se preocupe. En realidad no es así. Uh, de ahí, breakout rooms. Breakout rooms aparecen justo yo dejo de compartir y me aparece en los tres puntitos me aparecen los breakout rooms. Y dentro de, si ya está dentro de un grupo, de los grupos pequeños, usted puede utilizar el botón para pedir ayuda. Le da clic y ese me manda un mensaje que ustedes necesitan ayuda y yo voy y les ayudo. ¿Okay? Esta es la información para eh, realizar la clase de la mejor manera. Ok. Angelitos, let's continue. We're going to begin with favorite food. Favorite food. What's your favorite food? What do you usually like to eat? What's your favorite food? Pupusas. Pupusas. Yes, pupusas. Lasaña, chicken. So, lasaña, chicken. Mm -hmm. Pasta. Pasta. Pizza. Pasta, pizza. Uh -huh. Okay. Excellent. Yes. We're going to go to the groups and we're going to discuss these questions. Discuss these questions with your partners. What's your favorite type of food? What's your favorite food? Can you can you prepare it? Can you prepare your favorite food? Where do you eat it? Do you eat it at home? Do you eat it in a restaurant? Where do you eat the food, your favorite food? How often do you eat it? What is the frequency with which you eat the food? Every weekend? Every day? When? So how often do you eat it? When was the last time you ate it? Okay, so these are the questions. Uh, since you already have the class, you have to open it and share screen. So let's go. Let's go to the groups. Stop sharing now, yes. No I'm teacher. To, I'm going to give you permission for the ones who will be in the groups. So let's see if we have permission for the groups. It seems like. Mm -hmm. No, we don't have groups today, right? The groups have not been authorized. Okay, no problem, nobody dies. Let's continue. We're going to be working just like we always do. They haven't activated the, that part. Okay, then let's work together. Um, I would like a volunteer to ask the question. Ask different partners the question. Who wants to be the volunteer? I thank you, Juliana, and then Daniel. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Primero la damo. Yeah. Okay. Le hago una pregunta, verdad? Sure. You ask any person that you want. You choose the person. What's your favorite type of food? Uh-huh. What's your favorite type of food? Who? Who are you asking? Uh, me. Okay, please. My favorite food is... Lasagna. Lasagna, okay. Yes. And pupusas. Lasagna and pupusas. Okay, excellent. Very good. Thank you. If you want... Okay, now the next one will be Daniel. Please ask okay. the question. Uh, Gloria. What's your favorite food? 
My favorite food is lasagna. Lasagna, okay. Excellent. Very good. Now you may ask somebody else. Me or Gloria? Uh, Gloria. Okay. Pregunto. Yes, please. Siempre Daniel, la. Oh, Daniel, Daniel didn't ask. Did you ask Daniel? Yes, right. You asked Gloria. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Okay. Gloria, go ahead. Yes. Uh, what's your favorite food? Who Dan do you? Danny. Okay. Uh, sorry, Tania, mute uh, on the telephone. No problem. Uh, my favorite food is lasagna and pupusas. Lasagna and pupusas. Good. Very good. Okay. So don't buy lasagna on Mondays. Okay. On Mondays, don't buy lasagna. Why not, teacher? Because the, la the lasagna is made with uh, all of the pieces that are left over during the weekend and they put them yeah. in, the, in the lasagna. So the best is we eat lasagna maybe Wednesday or some other day. Mm -hmm. uh, Saturday. Or on Saturday. Okay. Yes. Teacher. Yes. I have a question. Tell me, Wilbur. Uh, what the different... Uh... The, the question first with the question two. The second, okay. The second, the second. Good question, Wilbur. The first question is, what's your favorite type of food? Mm -hmm. Mexican, Italian, no, Chi no Chinese. No, not these pupusas, uh, uh, In that case, the kind would, would be typical food, right? What's your favorite type of food? Typical food. What's your favorite food? Pupusas. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite type of food? Chinese food. Chinese. What's food. your favorite food? Italian food. Uh, maybe um, Cantonese rice, or maybe chow mein, chop suey. I don't know. So you say whatever uh, is your could favorite. Be, could be Italian food. Italian food, you can say pasta, ravioli, or pizza, okay, or pizza. Mm -hmm. Yeah, excellent. Yes, of course. Pomodoro. <laughs> Pomodoro is tomato, right? <laughs> tomato. Pomodoro. Okay, Pomodoro. So, like, so, like. Okay, the next one. So, what's your favorite food? Most people answer. Okay. Let's see. Glorita, can you prepare yeah. your favorite food? Yes. Yes, you can prepare your favorite food. Okay. How about Douglas? Can you prepare your favorite food? Um, no. <laughs> no, right? Yeah, only only weekend. Saturday on Sunday. Saturday and Sunday. Yes. I can cook some things Hi. but my favorite food pupusas for example i cannot i can cook lorocos in cream teacher i'm sorry yes liliana eh, so, ya pasó lista. yeah but don't worry it's okay okay ah okay excellent no problem liliana. it's okay it's okay welcome on board nice to see you again Okay, let's see. So, uh, Liliana, can you prepare your favorite food? Yo le estoy diciendo que I like um, the favorite food, ¿verdad? Yes. Eh, la lasaña, pizza, beans, chicken. Can you, can you prepare it? Can you prepare pizza? Can you make pizza? Si puedes prepararlo. Uh -huh. uh, no, no, solo, pero, o sea, solo si la 
no, solo, solo, solo la, para hacer la cacerola así, la que viene preparada. No, pero no, no. no. Eh, I only eat it, you say. Okay. It's okay, no problem. Thank you. Yes, thank you, Lilian. Okay. Let's see. Eh, Carla Idari Castillo. Can you prepare your favorite food? Um, no. No. No, no, you no. can't. Okay. I never prepare pizza. You never prepare pizza. Me neither. No. <laughs> okay. no. no. I have seen at uh, the supermarket, I have seen the, the, the dough and all the ingredients. But no, I never prepare pizza. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Somebody told me that it's easy, but I don't know. Maybe not. Okay, thank you. So, Danny, you can ask the other question. Thank you. Okay. Where do you eat? Where do you eat? Where do uh, you eat your favorite food? Yes, where do you eat favorite food? Who, Car who are you? Uh -huh. Carolina. Carolina. Hi, hello. Repeat, please. Where do you eat favorite food? My food is um, in my house. In your house. <laughs> in your house. Do you order or do you cook? No, yo, I. You cook. cook. Okay. Never. Oh, you never cook. No. Okay. Only my mother. You only cook your mother. Yes. No, teacher. I on, only my mother cooks. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> my yes. teacher, right? So. Mm -hmm. Okay, you, only your mother cooks. Does your mother cook deliciously? Yes. Yes, she does. Okay, excellent, very good. Let me see, Douglas, where yeah. do you eat your favorite food? Uh, I like prepare in my home that my favorite food is asado argentino. Wow, okay. Um, Pinchos and all of those things. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Mm -hmm. That's invite, nice. Invite. <laughs> exactly. Okay. Exactly. Uh huh. All right. Excellent. Daisy, what about you? Where do you eat your favorite food? My favorite food is pupusas. Uh, I eat pupusas in the restaurant. In the restaurant. Okay. Can you make pupusas? Uh, so so. <laughs> so so. Okay, a little, <laughs> a little. Okay, let's see. Julio, where do you eat your favorite food? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Uh, I. What is? It? Uh, what's it? The question. Okay. And where do you eat? Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Where do you eat? in my house? In your um, house. I like. Uh huh. I like to eat uh, fried fish. Fried fish. Your wife yeah. prepares it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Yeah. Very good. Nice. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Let me see. Then. Lady, what about you? Where do you eat your favorite food? Uh, my favorite food is barbecue. Wait. Would you please repeat? Your favorite food? Sorry? What's your favorite food, you say? Baby uh, wings. Baby. Anita? Ah, okay. Baby wings. Barbecue. <laughs> barbecue. Barbecue, <laughs> barbecue baby wings. Yes. 
okay. Barbecue. Yes. Okay. Where? At Buffalo Wings. I know prepare it. Prepare it? <laughs> ah, you, pre you prepare it in your house? Mm, no. 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 I mm. eat it at a restaurant. You eat it at a restaurant. Oh, okay. Excellent. Nice. Very good. Mm -hmm. Miguel Blanco. How often do you eat your favorite food? Repeat, teacher. How often do you eat your favorite food? Uh, the last uh, every weekend. Every weekend. Mm -hmm. Every uh, uh, every weekend. Roast meat. Oh, it's meat. Red your meat. Red meat. Okay. Red meat. Good beef. Uh, or pork, right? Pork. Pork or beef, Ooh, right? Ooh, beef. So you prefer like a red meat. Okay, excellent. How about Guillermo? Where do you eat your favorite food? Guillermo Delgado. Okay. How about Cindy Goches? Where do you eat your favorite food? Hi, teacher. Hello. Where do you eat your favorite food? Where? No, 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 le escucho bien, que aquí está lloviendo, perdón. Ah, okay, no problem. Sí. Where do you eat your favorite food? Ah, okay. Uh, I like to go to the Celeste Imperial restaurant. Ah, okay. My favorite food is uh, Chinese food. Chinese food. And how often do you eat it? Um, on a special occasion to celebrate. Okay. okay. Excellent. Very good. That's nice. Thank, Thank you. you. Yes, you're welcome. Okay. Omar, when was the last time that you ate your favorite food? No, Omar. Okay. Wilbur, what about you? When was the last time that you ate your favorite food? Today, teacher. Today? Sí. Wow. Okay. Beans and rice. Beans, Beans and rice. And rice. Oh, okay. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Beans and rice. Yeah, beans and rice is good. Yeah. Yes. My favorite is tomato, tomato with cream, fried tomato with cream, tomatada, right? So fried tomato, tomato with Tomato with cream. What? With cream. 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 Uh -huh. cream, fried, cream. Fried tomato with cream. Uh -huh. uh, it's, it's delicious. Yeah, it's very good. Very See, good. Yes. Yeah. It depends on the cream, but it's usually good. Very good. See. Okay. Excellent. Let's continue, my dear ones. We have a conversation. I really like to have gone to the groups because it's much better if you practice in the groups, but this is not activated. So unfortunately, we cannot go. Okay, so practice the dialogue with a partner, okay? Hi, Jessica. Hi, Andres. How are you doing? Great. What are you doing? Notice, how are you doing? And what are you doing? Okay, what are you doing? Having a snack. Have you eaten yet? Yes, I already have. What are you eating? It's banana balls. Do you like bananas? Yes, I do. I eat them three times a week. What other fruit do you eat? 
I eat oranges, pineapple, watermelon, melon, and mangoes. Really? I prefer grapes, strawberries, and cherries. I suppose you eat apples and pears too? Of course. Do you like exotic fruits such as jocotes and nances? Yes, but I don't eat them very often. I never eat them. They are difficult to find. True. Okay. Is it true that jocotes and nances are difficult to find? Yes, why? Well, mm, it's for temporada. Aha, uh -huh, it's true. Yeah. Right now, jocotes are popular. De momento, hay. Yes. Aún, aún, aún. A big, a, unir, aún. a big bag for one dollar. <laughs> one dollar, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Can you eat jocotes? Yes, I like jocotes. Yes. 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 Okay. I don't eat cocotes very often, but yes, they are very good. They're good. Okay, let's listen to the conversation again, and then we practice. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Andres. How are you doing? Great. What are you doing? Having a snack. Have you eaten yet? Yes, I already have. What are you eating? It's banana balls. Do you like bananas? Yes, I do. I eat them three times a week. What other fruit do you eat? I eat oranges, pineapple, watermelon, melon, and mangoes. Really? I prefer grapes, strawberries, and cherries. I suppose you eat apples and pears too. Of course. Do you like exotic fruits such as, such as cocotas and nances? Yes, but I don't eat them very often. I never eat them. They are difficult to find. True. Okay, so this conversation is between Andres and Jessica. So, two volunteers to practice the conversation. Who wants Me to be teacher. Andres? Me okay, teacher. I have two volunteers. Let's Me go. Teacher. Okay, let's, let's have turns. Julia. Hi, Jessica. Okay, begin, please. Uh, Juliana is Jessica. Okay, then Wilbur and Daniela. Okay. Hi, hi, Jessica. Hi, Andres. How are you doing? Great. What are you doing? Having a snack. Have you eat yet? Yes, I already have. What are you eating? It's banana ball. Do you like banana? Yes, I do. I eat them three times a week. What uh, other fruit do you eat? Mm -hmm. I eat orange, pineapples, watermelon, melon, and mangoes. Really? I prefer grapes, strawberry, and cherries. I suppose you eat apple, apples and pears too. Of course. Do you like exotic fruits such as jocotes? And nonsense. Yes, but I don't eat them very often. Mm -hmm. I never eat them. They are difficult to find. To find. <laughs> to find. Mm -hmm. True. Okay, thank you. That's it. Then we're going to have the next two. You remember who the next two are? Not teacher. Okay, if we follow the hands, we're going to have Daisy and Julio, okay? But the others, be attentive, you're going to be the next. So, begin. Uh, me toca con Nancy, en este Nancy. momento. Okay, yeah. soy Andrés. Uh... Daisy and... Ah, Andrés and Nancy, right? Andrés and Nancy, Andrés and, Hello, Nancy and then Julio and Daisy. Okay, yes, please go thank ahead. You, thank you. Yes. Begin. Perdón, hubo confusión. Creería que Tatiana, eh, Tatiana o... Hola. Sí, yo voy con usted, Julia. Sí. Ah, pero perfecto, no sé si perdón, primero perdón, otro, perdón. otro grupo. Andrés is first. Andrés is first. Don't worry, we can have uh, Daisy and Julio next. 
Okay. Okay. Adel. Inicia, Julio. Ah, perdón. Okay. Hi, Jessica. <laughs> Hi, Andres. How are you? Okay. How are you doing? Great. Uh, what What are you doing? Having a snack. Have you eaten yet? Eaten? eaten? Have you eaten yet? Uh, uh, yes, I already have. Uh, what, are you, what are you eating? It's banana balls. Do you like bananas? Yes, I do. I eat them three times a week. What other fruit do you eat? I eat orange, pineapple, watermelon, melon, and mangoes. Really? I prefer grapes, strawberry, and cherries. I suppose you, uh, I suppose uh, you eat apples and pears too? Of course. Do you like its exotic fruit? She has cocotes and nances. Yes. Uh, but I don't eat them very often. I never eat them. They are difficult to find. True. Okay, excellent, very good. Now the next one. Okay, me and Daniela, right? Yes, please. Okay, Daniela. Uh, hi, Jessica. Hi, Andres. How are you doing? Doing. Great. Uh, what Great. are you doing? Great. 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 What are you doing? Having a snack. Have you eaten yet? Eaten? Have you eaten yet? Yes, I already have. Uh, what are you? What are you eating? It's bananas balls. Do you like bananas? Yes, I do. I eat them three times a week. What other fruit do you eat? I eat oranges, pineapple, watermelon, melon, and mangoes. Really? I prefer grapes, strawberries, and cherries. I suppose you eat apples and pears too. Pears, apples and pears too. And pears, and of pears course. too. Of course. Do you like exotic fruits such as pacotes and nances? Yes, but I don't eat them very often. I never eat them. They are difficult to find. True, true. Excellent, very good. Okay, I imagine that Daniela and Julio already passed, right? So, let me see, Gloria and uh, who else? Who wants to go with Gloria? Maybe Eve Evelyn? Okay, Daniel says me. Okay, Gloria and Daniel then. Ahorita, teacher. Yes, please. Right now. Mm -hmm. Con Dani. Yes, please. Okay. Uh, ¿Comienzo yo? Sí. Okay. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Andrés. How are you doing? Great. What are you doing? Having a snack. Have you eaten yet? Yes, I really, I really have. What are you eating? It's banana bowl. Do you like bananas? Yes, I do. I eat them three times a week. What, what, what fruit? Perdón, teacher, ¿cómo se pronuncia eso? What? What other fruit do what you other, eat? What other fruit do you eat? What other fruit do you eat? I eat orange, 
pineapple, watermelon, melon, and mangoes. Mm -hmm. Oranges. Mm -hmm. Orange. Oranges. 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 Ah, okay. I eat oranges, pineapple, watermelon, melon, and mangoes. Really? I prefer grape, strawberry, and cherries. Strawberries and cherries. Strawberries and cherries. And cherries. I suppose. Mm -hmm. I suppose to eat apples and pears too. Apples and pears too. Okay. Apples and pears too. Of course. Do you like exotic fruits? Shoo, shoo, shoo at. Eh, jocotes and nances. Such as, such as, such as, such as, such as, such as, jocotes and nances. Okay. Excellent. Yes. Yes, but I don't eat them very often. I never eat them. They're difficult to find. Find. They're difficult to find. Find. Uh -huh. to find. True. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Okay. One more. One more pair. Yes. <laughs> Another pair. No more. No other pair. Okay. What's your favorite fruit? I love mango. I love mango, grapes. watermelon. Fruit. Mango, I watermelon. Fruit. Bananas. Bananas. Carambolas. Carambolas. Yes. <laughs> but carambolas only in refreshment. Yeah. Or do, yeah. you eat, do you eat them like that? Yeah, I do. Yes. Uh, okay, they call them. Uh, Let me see. No more, no more Lo defined. Love, love fruit, no. Passion fruit, they call it. Carambolas, passion fruit. Mm -hmm. Okay, why passion fruit? I have no idea. Okay, excellent. Uh, where do you buy your fruit? Where do you buy your fruit? Market. In the market. market. In, the, in market. the supermarket, okay. Yeah. Sometimes in the street, they sell the big bags of bananas or mangoes or jocotes. So they're very good. Okay. Excellent. Let's move on. Teacher, what um, do you say? Mercado, no, mar market. Mercado, merc market. Mercado, mercado. No. Market. Market. The market. the market, uh huh. Oh, you okay. normally say, es más barato. No, yes, definitely, no. yes. In the market, things are cheaper. Mm -hmm. Market, oh, okay. the other market. is the supermarket. In the supermarket, oh, okay. things are more expensive. Yes. One guayaba, one guayaba this big, it costs like almost one dollar, one dollar, one dollar and something. 125, 135 was, okay. and uh, you go to the market, they give you three, three guayabas for one dollar. So it's cheap. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's cheaper. Okay, let's see. Kinds of nouns. We have count nouns. Count nouns are the nouns that we can count. Mm, okay. What do you say like that? Why can you count them? Because they have plural form. You can say one, two, three, four, like one mango, two mangoes, three mangoes, four mangoes, five mangoes, etc. You can count them because they exist in unit. They are separated from the rest. You know that they are individual. They are individual. They exist in units. So they can be counted. One banana, two bananas, three bananas, one apple, two apples, three apples, etc. But non count nouns, non count nouns cannot be counted. They don't have a plural form. They don't exist in units. They cannot be counted by themselves. Example oil. 
you don't say one oil, one water, one soda. Well, you say soda for business. What do you say soda for business? Well, for business, you say like one soda is a can or a bottle, a bottle of soda or a can of soda. It's a standard, a standard unit. In that case, you can say one soda, two sodas, one beer, two beers, three beers, or one salad, two salads, three salads, one coffee, two coffees, three coffees. But coffee cannot be counted. In your house, you say, mom, please give me some coffee. Give me a little coffee. Give me a lot of coffee. But you don't say, give me one coffee. In business, yes, please give me two coffees. What, what are you counting? The cups. One cup of coffee. So give me one coffee. What? Small, medium, or large? The difference, very minimal. Small, medium, or large. So that is a standard. OK, examples of count nouns, books, cars, dogs, trees, people, that is one person, two people, three people, etc. Movies, cookies, photos, children, songs, women and men, actors, singers, shoes, buses, brothers, and vegetables. Okay, so this is like that, okay. Now, my dear ones, these are count nouns. What about non-count nouns? Soda, coffee, milk. So what's the meaning? All the liquids, the liquids cannot be counted. Okay, ice cream. Cake, pizza, teacher, but what's it, what do they have in common? Cake and pizza. Well, cake is made of flour. Flour, arena, right? Flour. Flour cannot be counted. You don't say one flour, two flowers, three flowers. No. But for business, you say one cake, one pizza, one pie. But for, for you to eat, you say, a piece of pizza or two pieces of pizza, a piece of cake, a piece of pie, okay? Because they cannot be counted. Cheese, one pound of cheese, two pounds of cheese, etc. a piece of cheese. Cream, a bottle of cream, some cream. Light, some light, a little light, etc. Snow. Rain, gold, music, food, money, food again, repeated, fruit, and jewelry. All of these are what? Uh, uncountable. They are uncountable. Okay. Do you have questions for the moment? Okay, you say, teacher, why is it important? Why is it important to know if they are count nouns or they are non-count nouns? Ah, okay. You say, in general, I like books, in plural. I like books. I like um, movies. However, if that cannot be counted, you say, I like music. I like uh, soda, I like coffee, I like uh, milk, okay? You don't say I like milks, no. I like milk, I like coffee in singular. But if they are countable, you use plural. I like bananas, I like oranges, I like mangoes in plural. So that's why it's important to know the difference, okay? Let's see. Match the different features on a product with its definition. Let's see. First, let's listen to the pronunciation. Size. 
weight, price, dimensions, or also dimensions. Dimensions, dimensions. Battery life, battery life. Storage, storage. Function, function. Warranty, warranty. Size, weight, price. Dimensions, battery life, storage, function, warranty. Okay, let's see. Now, my dear ones, we have to match them here. Measurements or proportions of some kind. What is that? Measurements or proportions of some kind. Dimensions. Dimension. Excellent. Yes. Let me see. I'm going to change color. Let's put yellow. Yes, teacher, it's hot. Let's use yellow. No, yellow the color, no yellow the, the cold water, okay? So, all right. A promise to repair, replace something within a period of time. Warranty. Warranty, mm -hmm. yes. Warranty. Excellent. A measure of battery performance and longevity. A measure battery. of battery, battery, life. Life. battery life. Battery life. Battery life, teacher. Excellent. Battery life. Battery, battery life. That's five. Uh, a thing's overall dimension of magnitude. How big is it? Big, small, whatever. What is it? Size. 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 Mm -hmm. Size. Okay, excellent. The space available for the retention of something. Okay, the space that we have for putting things in, for keeping things. The dimensions. Another one. Storage. 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 Mm -hmm. Yes. Excellent. A function now, uh, function now. Uh, okay. A body's, a body's relative mass or the quantity contained by something. Weight. The weight. The weight. Okay. This is incomplete, but the idea is that it's affected by gravity, right? That gravity. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Pulls it down. Uh -huh. Okay. The, um, the amount of money required or pay for something. Price. Price. Right. The price. Excellent. Practical use or purpose in design. When you make something, you think, oh. With this, okay. I want to do function. this. Function. 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 Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, very good. Wonderful. So, we finish this part. Okay. Let's see. Pronunciation. Size. Weight. 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 Price. Price, dimensions, dimensions, battery life, battery life, storage, storage, function, function, warranty, warranty. Okay, let's continue with it. Let's see. We have the questions. Okay. Douglas is going to be the moderator. Okay, Douglas, you are the moderator. You decide who you ask the questions to. Okay? Okay. Um, Tatiana. 
Yes. Uh, what products does your company buy? Uh, my company buy um, wine and spirit. Wine and spirit. Wine, wine and spirits. Wine okay. and spirits. Okay. Yes. Okay. Very good. And how many of each do they buy? Uh, Wilbur? We'll repeat. Repeat. Oh, oh. How many of each do they buy? Okay. How many? How many is of each do they buy? How many is countable teacher? Yes. Okay. The company buy and twenty five for products. Time is is okay. correct, teacher. Twenty five uh, units. Units. Mm -hmm. Como compramos twenty five de cada de cada tipo. Okay, you buy twenty five of each. Of each. 25 of each. Okay. Okay, very good. Okay, like this. 25 and... of each. Not teacher, no Mickey. Okay, let me see okay. probably here. 25 of each. Yeah. Okay. Yes, 25 of each. Uh -huh. of each product. product. Yes. 25 Good. of each product. Okay. Excellent. Uh, Sigo? Okay. Yes. Uh, Julio, uh, how often do they buy them? How often do they buy them? How often do they buy the products, Julio? They, uh, they buy this product uh, um, once, uh, once a week. Once a week. Uh, okay. Wow. Once a week. Very often. Very often. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Good. And Carla y Dari Castillo. The three... No, no está, creo yo. Okay, Evelyn Yamilet. Evelyn, uh, how much? Uh, how much money do you think they spend? How much money do you think they spend? For the byproducts in the company. Um, la pregunta es cuánto cuánto vale o cuánto How much vale? money do you think? How much money spend? How much is cuánto? Cuánto. Mm -hmm. How much money, money do they spend? Do you think in your opinion? ¿Cuánto dinero crees que gastan? I know. I don't know. A little, a little, a lot. A little money, a lot of money. A lot of money. Eh? A lot of money. A lot of money. Yeah. Okay. Very good. 
And the last question for Liliana. Liliana, Liliana Laura. Hello, Liliana. Okay. Hello. Why? Me ven en video, que no me veo aquí. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Why the top of your head, okay? Oh. <laughs> Pero sí se ve. Okay, why okay. do they buy them? Why do they buy them? Mm -hmm. Why do they buy them, Juliana? Why do they buy them? Um. Eh, eh, sería como se llama por because uh, me ven <laughs> si no me ve. yes go ahead no problem it's con the family como se llama necessary in family because it's necessary for the family, the family? ok uh -huh. the salvadorian family yes yeah. because we're talking about the company why do the companies buy the product? Why do the companies buy the product? Um, uh, uh -huh. Why do they buy them? Um, Walmart? Oh. Why is por qué? Why? Ah, okay, okay. Why do they buy them? ¿Por qué los compran? Why do they buy them? But, ¿Cómo se llama la canasta básica? ¿Cómo se dice? No, that's the, the basic food, but uh, or the staple food. But no, the companies, companies. Compañías. Mm -hmm. What do the companies buy? They buy machinery, equipment. Machinery? Uh -huh. Why? Why do they buy them? I know. <laughs> to use them or to sell them, right? To use them or to sell them? To use them or? To sell them. Sometimes they sell or sometimes they use. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Let's continue. We have a... Uh... Yes, Douglas, you can ask another person. Okay. Juliana, uh, Maria. It, teacher, the, the first uh, question, yes. right? Okay. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, or, or whatever question. Yes, you can ask the first question. Okay. Juliana Maria, uh, how often do they buy Dice them? Que Liliana, pero es Juliana. Oh, perdón, perdón. Juliana. 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 Mm -hmm. It's correct, right? Julie. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, Juliana. Juliana, Juliana. se pronuncia. Okay, Juliana. Uh, Juliana, how often do they buy them? The company. For you, company. Eh, puedo decidir cualquier producto. Uh, okay, repeat the company que... of the company is in your, your company. Your company. For example, yeah. if your company is about textiles, what products do they buy? Okay. Maybe needles, maybe threads. Sí, sí que me está preguntando con qué frecuencia compra, ¿verdad? Ajá. Ajá, pero ¿puedo decidir cualquier producto? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Usually buy... 
papelería, no sé. Ajá, paper. Eh, cosas de oficina. ¿Y how often do you buy this product? Both. Office supplies. How office supplies? What do they, how often do they buy them? Once a week, once a year. Weekly, monthly. Mm, month. Once a month. Okay. Sí. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Thank you, Douglas. Let's continue. Okay. Let's okay. Continue. Count nouns. Okay. With count nouns, we use some words right, such as a few, a few, like three, four, five. It's a few, not a lot just a few, fewer is a comparison. He has seven, I have five, I have fewer. He has seven mangoes, I have five mangoes. I have fewer mangoes than he does. Because he has seven mangoes, I have five mangoes. I have fewer mangoes. Few is for count now, okay? Talking about a small number, a small number, not a lot, but just a few. Three, four, five, right? A few. You say, how many hocotes do you eat? I eat a few hocotes. Okay. So, some, some is an indefinite amount, not big, not small. Any. You say, I don't eat any, zero. I don't eat any mangoes. What's the meaning? I eat zero mangoes. No, man no mangoes. I don't eat any mangoes. A lot. A lot means a big number. A lot. Okay. Many is also a big number. How many is for the questions? How many mangoes do you eat? How many? Cuantos? How many mangoes do you eat? Okay, example. I love mangoes in general. I love mangoes. How many pupusas do you want? I have six oranges and two bananas. I need a few eggs for the cake. I eat fewer oranges than you do. She needs some apples and grapes. Are there any cookies left on the shelf? Yes, there is still a lot of cookies. I usually don't eat many apples, many apples. How many pupusas do you eat a month? How many pupusas do you eat a month? How many mangoes? How many oranges? How many bananas? How many, okay, cucumbers, um, et cetera. Count nouns. You remember count nouns are objects that can be counted. You say one mango, two mangoes, three mangoes, four mangoes, so they can be counted. Teacher and count is what? Contar can be counted, pueden ser contados, right? They can be counted. So, check. Those are the examples. Complete with a few and a lot. A few, a lot. A few, a lot. Okay. Volunteer for number one. Who wants to do number one? Mm -hmm. A lot. Read the... Money. Re read the complete sentence, please. I usually I eat, eat a lot, great, a lot. Okay, I usually eat a lot of grapes a month. Okay. Uh -huh. 
a uh, lot of grapes and mangoes. A lot of excellent uh, volunteer for number two. Yeah, Who wants two, to do number two? Yes, I please. never buy any apples. Okay, I I never buy many apples. Teacher, I why not buy, any? Yeah. Any I have a question. This any means zero. Zero apples, no apples. Okay. Okay. And then it says a few. Poquitas, poquitas, a few. Then many. I okay. never buy many apples, only yeah. a few. Number three. Volunteer for three. Who wants to do three? Many. Many. Okay. Please read the complete sentence. Toda la oración. My sister eats many hamburgers. A month. My sister eats many hamburgers a month. Very good. Yes. Four. Volunteer for four. A few. Yes, Danny. A few, teacher. Uh huh. Would you That's please right. read a few? Read all of it. Uh, a few. Yes. Yeah. This uh, what do you places of bread do you eat in a week? Uh, how many pieces of bread do you eat a week? Many or well, a few? A few. Pizza. Pizza. Okay. Number five. Volunteer for five. Do you eat money cookies? Do you eat many cookies? Uh -huh. Do you eat many cookies? No, no only, only a few. few. In very much? No. Okay. Excellent. Nice. Do you eat quick? Cook. Okay. Yes, Omar, you want to say six? They, uh... Maybe. Bet Betty usually buys um, a lot of uh, um, Betty usually buy many books buy uh -huh. a few books and magazines Betty usually buys a few books in mind. Seven. So most magazine or book of magazine. What are you saying, seven? And many, I don't get many messages. Oh, what's up? Okay, I don't get many messages on WhatsApp, only a few. Number eight. She has only a few friends. She's very shy. 
Aha, she has only a few friends. She's very shy. Very good. Nine. He has many ties to do too. Today. He has today. many things to do today. Leave him alone. Many things to do today. Leave him alone. Excellent. Number 10. What do we say for number 10? Mary has a lot of the shoes of different colors. Exactly. A lot of shoes in different colors. Nice. How about 11? I had a few words to say. I'm shy. I have a few for, words to for, say. For me. I'm shy. And the many fifth words. 12. What about 12? They play many games. Ah, uh -huh. yeah. They play many games. They are always they playing. They are always playing. Excellent. Now let's continue with non count now. The purpose Teachers? Is Question? Yes, lady. Ask the question, señorita. Eh, ¿Cuál es la diferencia entre many y a long of? Okay. In... Let's say that a lot of is less formal. A formality. Formality. What is formality? You use one word with people that are your friends. Many. No, sorry. A lot of. But you want to be formal, you use many. Okay? Okay, with thank people you. that are not your friends, but the same means. No internet. My dear ones, 